I thought it'd be fun to pick up right where we left off. Ba boom. Yeah. So a lot of this field right here is done. And almost all of this one is done as well. And I'm going to completely ignore all these little bits right here. I don't need that. I don't, I don't need all that trouble in my life. <laughs> That's going to be too much trouble. But I am going to try and get as much of the straw off of here as possible. Oop. Looks like we got a little bit of here. Still got some of these little spots over here. But I'm going to try and do these up kind of... I don't know. I think maybe coming from the other side might be a good idea to do this. This way... Uh, you know what? I actually don't... I don't know what the best way to do these would be. I think I'm just going to hire a worker and forget about it. While that guy does his thing, I'm going to come over here and unload this guy real quick. Because I might not have been paying attention while I was doing this off screen. And so we got to fill this thing up real quick. We've actually got a bunch of stuff. Look at this. 184,000 liters of wheat and 181,000 liters of canola. That canola number is going to go real sky high. I know I said I wasn't going to get it, but but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come over here and get this stuff. <laughs> I did at least turn the straw soft off. The straw swap. Yeah, there you go. I did turn that off because it would be a bit of a nightmare coming through here trying to do that. There you go. One harvest down. We got a good amount out of here as well. For some reason, I thought I saw a car. Oh, that was about to suck. I really do like driving in this grass field. It makes it so easy. We do have a little bit left here, so I'm going to go ahead and dump that into the silo. Can I get it? Nice. It should fill up the bag and then completely dump again. So at least, well, there's that. Go ahead and pull this right in here. And I think, at least for right now, oh, crashed into it. Uh, we're done with this uh, harvester, at least for right now. And now we're back to this one again right here. Uh, we only got 4,000 liters of sweet, or, uh, canola off of that little spot right there. So, well, I guess there's that. Uh, we need to go ahead and line this up. Hopefully, no straw coming out. All right. Um, trying to figure out what the best way to do this is going to be. I think maybe start all the way over here from one side and then make just hire him out and let him work. And that's exactly what we gonna do. Let's go and let him do his thing. There's not much else here. Up and down, be able to hit this in one pass. Field number one is done, but I need to find a thing. Where's a thing? This is exactly what I want. Yeah, you knew what I was gonna do. Don't even act like you didn't know what was going on here. I'm gonna go pick all that straw up and I'm gonna sell it. Actually, you know what? We could probably keep it. <laughs> Just thinking about this. The uh, soybean straw, yeah, we could sell that, but we could actually manage to save some straw and not have to buy any. That might come in handy. And here we go. I do love that this combine harvester leaves just enough where I can hit three straw swaths at once. Ah, oh, makes it so nice. Yo, something just came to my attention. There's a Teal'ex Phoenix for, not for free, but cheap in here. Yo, dude. I, I might, I might have to go through and make one of these. Hang on. And here you go. This is what I'm going with right there. Oh boy. I don't, I don't know where that is. Oh, it's in the middle of a field. Whoa. Yeah, she loud, all right. Biggest problem is I don't have a semi-trailer to go along with this yet. We'll actually have to buy one. So I think for now, we'll just kind of put this away. Actually, doesn't this have a hidden hitch on it? If it does, it should hook up to one of these, uh, one of these balers if I can get in here. It should hook right up. And it does, look at that. All right, so it will hook up, which means that I'm gonna swap this truck out for the tractor and we're gonna get that field picked up quick all right so we're all hooked up did i leave this on no i didn't leave it on we're good we're good we're good we're gonna pull this to the side and we're just gonna park it in the middle of the trees and then we'll hook this up actually it makes it really really easy we should be able to go stupid fast with this and that's kind of what i'm what i'm banking on right here we'll go ahead and hook it up make sure that suggested speed is on and it is and we'll turn it on Running some of these in, in rows right here, these might be a little bit more difficult to hit than, uh, well, than what I would like, but yeah, we are just, hang on. What was that? Is that a little toy? It was, check that out. All right, come on turbo, push it through. I forgot the aggro tires were a thing. So we're just gonna, yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna hook that up. There we go. Much better. And now we are done. Yeah. So we're done with this. 
Uh, we're, 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 there's so much going on right now. I got a truck in the middle of this field. I got a truck in the middle of this field. We're doing pretty good here. We got 1.3 million liters of straw picked up so far. And man, we got so much more to pick up. It's just, oh, there's, <laughs> there's just so much to do. So we're going to take all of the straw from the other field as well. So as soon as I finish this field, we're going to head over to that canola field. We're going to pick up all that straw because it's technically the same straw as far as the game's concerned. And then we'll be taking all of the crop and getting it sold and getting that sweet old payday. FJ's been picked up 3.5 million liters of straw. This thing holds, I think it's 10 million liters. And <laughs> it's, oh, it's doing just fine. This is insane. One thing that I want to do is check this price for straw because I kind of want to sell this. I don't really want to keep it. Um, North Valley Bell seems to be the best place. So let's head up there. One nice thing, I can get in here. <laughs> Ain't gotta worry about nothing. All right, so this is gonna sell pretty quickly. I don't know how much money we're gonna make off of this, but this is all literally free money. $541,000 of free money, I will take that. Guess I really can't complain about not having the money for a trailer anymore. <laughs> It costs us $115,000 and another three grand to be delivered, but who cares? I've got a new, a new carting rig now. Yeah, and this is actually gonna help out a lot with what we're about to do. Hey, got both of them semi trucks lined up together. Oh, unfortunately, this one's gonna have to move. I do love this truck though. Man, that's such a cool truck. I'm just gonna like put it out here though, because I don't really know what to do with this truck right now. So, right there it goes. But this one. Yeah, this one's a little bit different. The first stop is going to be, I don't know, wheat or canola, whichever one's first. The wheat works. So this is going to be going to the Stone Valley Fuel Shop, which we're very, very familiar with that place. That's going to be down here on the bottom of the map, I think, right? Right there it is. We'll go ahead and tag that place. We see it. The Jake Break is moving. Yeah, we'll kind of pull through here. I don't know why, but I always come through like right there. All right, we'll hit this. The last I checked, at least in the last previous update, this was a little bit high, but looks like here we are totally fine. We'll go and get this dumped out and we're gonna sell all of it. I don't care if this is the worst price for the wheat. We're gonna be selling every single bit of it. And there's a little bit of money right there, not bad. 80 grand extra, cool. All right, so the contract on field number, what did that say, 80? Yeah, field number one. That's, that's what we're looking for here. We'll go ahead and collect this. This is $40,000 extra for that. <whistles> Making good money. Next is Canola. And this is our only other contract. And I don't think I'm going to take any more. Probably the rest of the uh, series. I'm not quite sure if I'm if that's realistic or not. But here we go. Where are we going? South Valley Stores. Now, where is South Valley Stores at? Found it. Bottom left-hand corner. What? Me driving through other people's fields? I don't care. <laughs> hey all right we'll pull it through back it around bring it in and we'll be good and again right here we're just gonna sell whatever's left i don't i just don't really care too much to sit around and wait all right unhook god those animations all the hooks are super cool we'll go ahead and dump this out because super fast we'll just hang on to it and we got an extra one hundred twenty thousand dollars on top uh collect there we go of like 50. We are one millionaires. Again, yes. Now for the fun part. We're gonna jump in here. We're also gonna fill it up with fuel again. Don't tell anybody I did that. Uh, yeah. One of the things I love most about this combine harvester, it is big, it is powerful, it is loud, and it's a zero turn. Yee-hoo! <laughs> hey, uh, there's also a lot of like, well, at least when there's no header attached, you can see a lot out of this thing. Once you put it up, yeah, you can't really see nothing. And I do love that sweet, sweet 31 miles per hour. All right. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to harvest this field. Uh, this should kind of put us in line with where I want to be before we finish up this series. Because the final kind of setup is going to be plowing all of these fields together with the exception of this one little road going into it and that is going to be a big big harvest we've also got to do some grass as well so i think what we'll do is probably get to a point where we can actually hire a worker here 
and then maybe get some grass done or possibly we'll have to wait until the next episode to do the grass work. Little check in. We are literally nailing it right now. Uh, as you can see up here, well, we've got the first section of, well, this is technically one field right here. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and start working on picking up the soybean straw, which of course we're going to be selling and getting money from it. We should be good to go. We're doing all right. Doing all right. Uh, the only thing is with, of course, this section right here, we've done it. We got to still do that section. And then all of those are going to have to be done separately. So let's make it happen. So this is taking a whole lot longer than I thought it was going to take. I thought maybe, you know, it won't be that bad. No, this is taking a long time. <laughs> So, I brought in a little bit of help to possibly, uh, well, help. I've got some of these smaller little bits of the field that I could be totally doing right now instead of sitting waiting on that big combine harvester, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. One thing I'm going to try not to do is split these up a little bit. They are in little, 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 little like, kind of individual fields, so I'm going to try and treat them like that. I don't, I don't know how well that's going to go. But I'm going to do my best. And we hired a little baby worker right there. And this looks like... Is that really it? <laughs> hey -oh. All right, we'll just kind of boop. Just like that. Maybe wait for the straw to come out. Is there even enough? There you go. All right. So now we get to figure out which of these fields is bigger. I think this one up here at the top is going to be the largest. So we will hire our worker on here. But I am still going to have to run these two headlands. Uh, we're moving along though. We poop over here. Poop over here. <laughs> LOL. Uh, we've got the smaller area there done, and we got this guy doing his thing there. So it's working. Everything's working great. Uh, this is a lot to do, but it's working. And the worker has been hired. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. And we've even got this guy right here. I think I could probably fire him out and then maybe. I don't do this myself. Think I could do this? We do have one, well, two little spots there left, but I think we probably knock those out fairly quickly. I will try and use a worker as much as possible, especially because it makes picking up all of the soybean straw super easy. Again, soybean straw is part of the base game of Stone Valley. Pretty cool. Honestly, the hardest part about finding with some of these fields is finding a straight line that's like a 90 or something that's going to be worker friendly. This is about as good as it's going to get for me right here. Actually, this really isn't too bad overall. So we're going to take full advantage of it. Still doing good so far, man. Uh, I've got a lot of this area picked up already. Most of it is, but we've still got one of these. Is that my tractor? It was my tractor. I need this guy. Yeah, this dude right here. Please fire the worker. Thank you. Uh, we're at 91% right now. We've gotten a bunch of soybeans, boys. Uh, I think I'm just going to let dude right there finish his own field. That way, at least the, the runs are the same between the uh, soybean. But I'm just going to go ahead and hit this field by myself real quick. There ain't nothing to it. I could probably do this in less than two passes back and forth on each side. Yeah, we're going to be okay. Told you. <laughs> I went around the whole thing twice, so that did it. That did it. Yeah. So we have, what is that, 95,000 liters in here. That ain't bad at all. I, I'm not really sure where I'm going to put this huh, header. But this seems like a pretty good place for now. Boop! And now to finish all of this up, we are going to have a great, great sell when this is all said and done. But the next episode's going to be so long. And the last bit right here, I figured I'd do it myself just to celebrate. There we go! That's it! Harvest is over! We got so much more work to do, but harvest is over. Yeah. This poor TLX though, man. It looks like I hit a dirt monster and it exploded everywhere. <laughs> it's a little funny. Uh, I decided what better way to end harvest than to, oop, not hit a cow. Do a nice little double dunk. You guys know what's going on right here. Let's do right about there. Double dump, baby. Let's go let's go back inside the dirt cap uh we're gonna go ahead and sell this stuff this seemed to be the best price like 6600 something like that we'll take a look at it real quick before we get started with the sale and there we go perfect now how much was it giving us i think we're over here i don't actually remember the name of this place uh maybe this is it yeah yeah that's it 6588 what do we get huh <clears throat> two million 
Brr. Uh, you know, we could definitely buy field one uh, with that amount of money. We could buy field number 17 with that amount of money. We could do whatever we want with that amount of money. We can even drive through everybody else's fields. I don't care. I'm a millionaire. Y'all get out of here. Uh. And just like that, we are done. Literally done with harvest now. The big question is going to be, where can we sell soybean straw? North Valley Bells. Looks like it's a little bit better up there. Sell everything. Come on. What are you doing? Of course, I forgot I'm in this tractor. Yeah. Man, I drove all the way up here. It's just a do this <laughs> god i hate this area so much this sucks ah come to put get get out of it no get oh i'm gonna put this on the roof come on yeah that works see see how easy that was super easy barely an inconvenience didn't cause me any trouble problems nothing three hundred twenty six thousand dollars good I, you know, I wanted that. So we have $3.3 million. The question is going to be, what are we going to do with that amount of money?